Okay, check it out guys. Finally got some thick St. Augustine. It's really thick over here. Now that's more like it. So this is going to be a neat mow. Well, let's get started. Okay, so that was the fun part, but, and it came out looking really good, but unfortunately, cheetah definitely does not fit in the backyard, and it's a big backyard, so let's go get the craftsman.
Okay, so there's that. Hey, you know what? I know some of you guys are nervous about filming. Here's a tip. Do this. I'm going to show myself in the mirror. When you're talking to your customer, make sure that you have a camera on a tripod in your hand. And then that way they'll know you're filming. And if they're going to say anything about it, they're going to say anything about it right then and there. Get that out of the way. Nobody's ever said anything, by the way. So that's how... That's how much you gotta worry about that. Anyway, just a little tip. Let's do some edging. Okay, so there's a backyard. You know, this is about as close as it gets to stripes here. Grass is just really, really thick. I cut this at three and three quarters, but St. Augustine oftentimes is four or four and a quarter, and it just doesn't stripe that well. But sometimes looks pretty good. So, look what we have here. That is the Florida Black Racer, and I just have to mess with it. <laughs> now if he goes up in this plant, I've got him. And they usually do. I scare him into the plant, and they'll go to the top of the plant. Nope, I found him. If you look really carefully, he did exactly like I thought he was going to do. He crawled up into the plant there, and he's watching me. But I'm going to grab him. Here we go. One, two, three. I missed. All right, he's down there now. Right down there. I'll never get them there. I mean, I'll try. Let's see if I can get them. One, two, three. Got him. Okay, I have spotted him again. He is right there. He is proving to be really pretty hard. Oh, he's going to strike. I think he's going to strike. Go ahead. You just strike. <laughs> I look at him. Okay, here we go again. He's proving to be very tricky to catch. I think the problem is that I am right-handed, and I was trying with my left hand. So here we go. I'll try with my right hand. One, two, three. Ah, I missed again. So now he's down here. Got to get him this time. Where did he go? Is 
There he is. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Ah, missed. All right, so he just he just plain got away. I have no idea where he went. Sometimes they can be very elusive. And I was being extra cautious. You know, they are not poisonous, but they definitely bite. And they have a really good bite. And now I looked everywhere. I can't find them. Sometimes they just get away. I just wanted to show them to you. A little closer, but I guess you got a good look at them. Anyway, I believe that is going to wrap it up for this one. I'll show you the front. Don't worry, there'll be plenty of snakes in the future. We have the eastern diamondback rattlesnake out here. Got the coral snake. Oh, the pine snake, the garter snake, the red rat snake, the yellow rat snake. Got lots of stuff. I'm sure I'll run into all those, but anyway, let me take a look here. See there? There is the whole yard. It came out real nice. And you know, sorry about a one yard vlog, but what can you do? Anyway, thanks for watching everybody. I think that was vlog 13. Have a good one.